What's going on, everybody? Bruce here from Bruce's Gaming. Happy Friday. We are back here on Deadwood. We're going to uh, test out uh, a few new mods here and just have some fun playing around on the new Deadwood map, uh, which is going to be coming for all platforms from uh, Poor Boy Modding and myself. So sit back and enjoy. Hopefully you all have had a good Friday. TGIF. What's going on, Ronnie? How are you doing today? Good to see you, bud. Hopefully you're having a good afternoon. Got a few people in here already. Running a little bit late. We were watching a movie. Uh, we started it kind of late because we saw that there was uh, one of the movies we've been wanting to see. Uh, we watched The Beekeeper with Jason Statham. Uh, if you haven't and like those type of movies, I highly recommend watching it. It was really good. Uh, I really think it's his best movie yet. Uh, Non-stop action the whole way through it. So, so right now, before we get going, there's, uh, I did this all off camera. I cut down and there's, uh, 75, 80 trees cut down from over there that I cut. And I don't, I can't cut any more of them. That's all part of a different property. So before we get going, we only have 22,000. We're going to go sell another load of logs here real quick, like. I am going to uh, turn my run speed on so I can run a little faster. You're doing good. Awesome. Good to hear, man. Yeah, I, I, I'm, I'm going to get it here. Uh, I want to get some money so I can at least lease it. I want to test it out on uh, a couple of the fields there. Uh, I do believe we're going to be able to get it harvested, so... It's definitely, it was watching DJ Goham's video on it, you know, it's definitely uh, pretty crazy. Uh, and I loaded this up last night manually. Uh, I used a different uh, claw on the excavator and it works a lot better. Ronnie, coming in with that $5 super chat. Thank you, man. Appreciate it. Everybody hashtag Ronnie. Hopefully everybody got the notifications. Uh, everybody gets jumped in here real quick. It's Friday. It was the uh, was the farm sim show on today, or weren't they doing it today? I didn't see a notification. I think it would have been on Clutch's channel though. Money, David. What's up? Thank you, Kermy. Appreciate that. How you doing? Let me uh. Pin that up at the top, pin that, and hashtag in for Ronnie. Boom. Scroll down just a little bit. There we go. Boom. Yo. So, poor boy uh, did tell me he got the, uh, the air fixed uh, for the grass that uh, on here. And uh, he was sending it back again today. Loving the new harvester. Nice, nice. I haven't used it yet. I just installed it so I could uh, try it out here on the map. So here we go. We're going to sell our load of wood. Okay, we made 168000 We didn't make quite as much today as we did yesterday, but that's all good. But thanks for coming by, David, Ronnie. Good to see everybody. Happy uh, Friday. TGIF to everybody. Another beautiful day here. Seeing one of his map updates drop today. Yeah, Crater Lake. Uh, it had failed the same day as Deadwood, and he got it fixed right away and sent it back in. And it went into testing really quick. So that was fantastic. And then he did tell me yesterday it was pending release, and he figured it would be today, so which was really good. So we're just going to park this here right now. I got lots of trees to clean up, but we're not going to do that right now. Hey, Rank, what's up? Welcome. Good to see you. So we're going to hop here, and uh, there's the uh, the new claw that I was using. It is... It was in that same pack from FSG, and uh, it actually grabs and holds a lot better. 
New Harvester is awesome, right? Only holds about 30,000 liters, right? Or 29,000 or something. Uh, did I hear DJ saying? I haven't looked at it. I just installed it here before I come on. Uh, updated uh, two of the mods that uh, came out. The chicken coop from the Lort and uh, Omatana's uh, open garden. Oh, updated those two. So we're going to go down here. Uh, I did mow all that grass around the fields down here last night. I did that all off camera. So we're going to bail it up and uh, test out Yosa's uh, fermenting, bale fermenter uh, mod out, which I know it works because I tested it over on a different map. Uh, and it, it's going to be a game changer on a couple of poor boys maps. Not much, just waiting for MRG to release the update for Medicine Creek. Ah, okay, Zay, he's supposed to do that today, right? Take around 25K. Okay, cool. But welcome. Got five awesome people watching. Appreciate it. As you can see, we got all that done. Um... Uh, might not have a field to harvest. We might have to change that. <laughs> but uh, as you can see, I got all that grass there. We can uh, go ahead and get get done. Not much. Okay, I read that already. Sometime today, okay. Yeah, he usually releases them really late, right? Trio, what's up? How's it going, man? TGIF to you. Y'all better be smashing that like button. Show them the love. Yeah, thanks, David. Appreciate it. Ooh, all right. It's already open. Froggy. So let's see. Do we have... Uh, I want to get... I might have to just get a contract to do. Because my none of my fields are ready to go. So that's probably what we'll just do. We'll probably just get a contract. Harvesting. Uh, we've got a field two, a sorghum. Oh, uh, that's parsnips, oats, 13, how big is it, 15 acres, 18. So that's a sorghum field, so we'll accept that contract. We'll use the, uh, the new harvester down there on that. Hey, hey, Mr. Z, what's up? Welcome. Good to see you. Hope all is well. Missed you this week. I've been swamped getting ready for surgery. Ah, okay. Good luck on the surgery, man. Good to see you. Glad you was able to make it in before then. Hopefully the surgery goes good for you. We're going to unfold this and uh, try this out here real quick. Let me see. 180 centimeters. I want to, I can, I should be able to reset that baler somehow. Yeah, right, uh, right there, reset the bell counter. Okay, I had to turn it off. 80 bucks for a harvesting contract. Bruce, an ad just played, and it's been one year since that ad has played. Oh, ha, ha, ha. Hey, well, at least the ad played, man. Watch it through, man. Watch it through. <laughs> Helps the channel. Saul Goodman, just a total knee. All good, man. Just a total knee replacement. Should be a piece of cake considering the other 13 I've already gone through on my spine. Oh, yikes. All right. So we're going to hit that. 
We're going to go a little faster here, but I've got to go slow because the uh, baler just doesn't quite keep up with the uh, thicker rows. Yeah, good luck, man. Knee replacement. Uh, my, uh, my landlord just had one of them here, I think it was. Hey, Richard, what's up? Welcome. Good to see you. Thanks for coming by today. That's not going to pick it all up, but I guess that's kind of good. Happy Friday to everybody, TGIF. You all know. All know it. Hopefully everybody's had a good had a good week. Good afternoon. Holy cow, that was a 50,000 liter bale. And there we go. There's our first bale. Uh, we, we do have Yosa's mod installed. And... That is instant silage right there, everybody, from uh, a PC only, unfortunately, but pretty pretty cool. Glad uh, Yos uh, made that mod for us. Yeah, eighty dollars for a harvesting contract. Where'd you see that? Oh yeah, right there, field uh, field seventeen. That must be one tiny field, right? Oh, that's uh, that's one of them fields over here by the houses, uh, David. That's why. <laughs> Is that one right there? That comes with plot 28? It's that little sorghum field uh, by the houses? So how's everybody doing? Hey, Nick, what's going on? Welcome. Good to see you. TGIF to you. Hopefully Nick has had a good day. Definitely good to see everybody. That ain't a field. That's a garden. Yeah, exactly. It's yeah, That's a garden. <laughs> Doing pretty good. Just playing some Fallout 4 before the update next week. Oh, okay, nice. Fallout 4. I goofed around on Fallout 76 the other day. That's the first I'd ever played a Fallout game. Really wasn't too impressed with it. You got two friends named Nick in real life? Nice. That's good. I had, uh, I used to work with a guy, his name, uh, his, uh, the kid, his name was Nick. He worked uh, at the lumber mill I used to work at. Fallout New Vegas is where it's at. Okay. People called me Nickelodeon. Oh, <laughs> Ooh, poor. I don't think I'd like a. That that would be a. Uh, I don't know. That nickname would get old after a while, Nick. The the Saint Nick one ain't wouldn't be bad for like Santa Claus, you know, like ho ho ho. has a truck and the license plate says Nico. Ah, okay. <laughs> right? 
So how's everybody doing? How's everybody's weather? Real nice day here. Uh, I think it was in the 60s again today. I think. All right, picked up that little bit of hay right there. That was uh, there was a hay blotch right there, kind of weird. So his truck calls him Nico. <laughs> Seventy here today. Nice, nice. Eighty-two yesterday. Ooh, nice. I want to try the weird looking harvester. Yeah, I I grabbed it. I'm gonna use it. That's why I grabbed the harvesting contract because none of my fields are ready yet. So we, we will be trying it out. I haven't used it yet. Um, we watched a movie, so I wasn't able to. We were watching. We watched The Beekeeper today. Really good movie. I will say when you load the hopper onto that trailer, you have to be extremely close. Ah, uh, okay. I saw a DJ was talking that it, it that there wasn't any collision on the arm, so which kind of makes it good. Harvester that came out, the packet looks unique and cool, right? Yeah, Fallout was good. We we've, we've got it all watched. They've uh, signed on to make a season two of it already, so which is good. So we've bailed, we've got seven bales so far, but the bales are 50,000 liters, so. Uh, Fallout is on Amazon Prime, Nick. And the beekeeper for us was on MGM Plus. They just put it on there for free. I was actually going to rent it because uh, Amazon has, uh, Prime has had it on to, for a while now. And I was actually going to get it because I still had uh, a perk left for that for like a free movie. Not enough capacity for me to use the next app. I do like it though, right? Yeah, I can I can change that hopefully, uh, Mr. Z. I think David, uh, I think they only said it was like 25, 29,000 liters or something like that. You got Prime? Nice. I like Prime. There's a lot on there to watch. Pretty much same capacity as other harvesters. That's what I kind of thought. It would have the same capacity. That's good, though. I'll be back in a few. Okay, Nick, I'll be here. I'll be here. Play large map solo. Running 23K capacity isn't fun for me. I'll stick with the Colossus or Reaper. <laughs> right? That way you can get max capacity and throw a worker on it and let it go. Go do whatever else you need to do. Yeah. 
get you. That's kind of what I do. Unless I'm playing and not using a worker. Kind of like how I like to do set a worker off and go get the green cart and unload when I'm using the lower capacity stuff. I'll be lurking, been busy for the past 45 minutes. Okay, Groot, thanks for coming in, bud. Good to see ya. Don't work too hard, man. Okay, hopefully we can get rid of all this here. All right, there we go. We're going to get a little bit of grass left in here. I wanted to want to switch this baler out. So I'm going to have to mow some more grass eventually. So there we go. We made 12 bales at 50,000 liters a piece. So what's that? 60,000, 60, 600,000 liters? No way bashing the mod. I just don't have you. Yeah, exactly. It. Oh, there we go. I, I get you. I understand where you're coming from. Not everybody's gonna gonna like it. Ugh, excuse me. Hey, Logan, what's up? Your empire has risen. Ooh. Are you on the dark side, Logan? So we'll go ahead, we'll uh, pull this out here for now. I'm gonna shut that down. So let's see here, let's check our field out that we gotta harvest. Okay, it's that's over field two. So we gotta go over there to uh, grab that. And they uh, sort them. I was playing a game where you can have your own kingdom. It's called World Box. Oh, okay. So let's see here. That thing here in the harvesters. Uh, I bet. Let's see, where is it? Probably all the way at the end. Where's that thing show up at? Uh, miscellaneous? Activated it? I know I did. Large tractors. Oh, all right. They don't consider it a harvester then. Okay. Oh, right there. U.S. version? Let's do... Uh, okay. We'll do Fent Green. Uh, John Deere Yellow. Looks kind of like a John Deere, huh? I think that's pretty funky looking, right? <laughs> My army is big. Four billion soldiers. Hoppers and miscellaneous. Okay, thank you. 
$397,000. Holy buckets, am I going to have enough money to rent it? Say, we're going to lease it since we're just using it on a harvester or on a, that, that field. So we'll lease it. Uh, oh, crap. Might be, hey, unknown Kansas boy. What's up? Oops, it's down at the other field. You know what? Let's uh let's just close this out. We're gonna we'll use this and we'll take the trailer down there. I don't How's unknown Kansas boy doing? Good to see ya. Good to see everybody. We've got twelve awesome people watching. We're getting ready, we're gonna use the uh the new harvester that came out, aka the, the next cat, next next at or however you pronounce it, next cat. You have to have the trailer as well if you want to move it. Oh, really? You can't move it with everything on it? I uh, I got the spawn point isn't at the shop anymore. It's down here by the fields because I got a couple items delivered down here. So it's it's down here. It'll be across from the field where we need to go. We'll probably get it all. Kenny, what's up? Nope. <laughs> How you doing? Not efficiently. <laughs> okay, should be interesting then. Yeah, I think I think it looks pretty wide, David, from the pictures and all that. We're only gonna move it across the road there, but hey, we're gonna we'll test it all out, see how it works. I need to get over here to the uh, field to the left. The uh, sorghum field is what we're going to be doing. So it definitely wouldn't fit down the road or in in there in here probably. So let's see what we got. We're over here. Boom. Uh, is it there or is it over there? Uh, it's over here. There we go. Holy cow, look at that thing. Hmm. That, thing, that thing's pretty funky. I'm, uh... I'm gonna just back it up. For now. If you change driving directions, it will fit down the road without the harvester box attached. Okay. So, let's see here. Now let's buy our attachments. Headers. We can use any header, right? If I remember right. So since we're not doing a real big field, we'll, uh, we'll just get this one for now. Uh, we'll lease it. Works good though. Okay, click X on the keyboard to fold. Just like that. Boom.
There we go. Uh, there we go. We want all wheel steering. 45 foot header boost. 15 meter is perfect. Yeah, that one there might be kind of small, right? <laughs> Sorry I'm late. Hey, Waylon, welcome. Okay, yeah, that probably should have just drove mine down here that I have. We just leased that one, so let's go ahead and uh, get rid of it, I think. How about that? You're missing a part. Yeah, I haven't gotten everything yet. Where the hell is it? Is it here? You said it was in miscellaneous, correct? It almost needs its own category. Yeah, I, I need the box and then need for I can so I can get the attached the header to it, right? There it is. Boom. Uh, we'll release that. And that's the one you need the trailer for to uh, move it. Going lizard all the way at the end. Yeah, I don't ever, I don't ever do a search like that for some reason, Kenny. I just go to where it needs to be. <laughs> Thanks, man. Yeah, if you want to attach the header to it, then you, yes, you will. Okay. Oh, looks kind of simple, right? <laughs> so we got that. Now, now we need to go get our header. I just want to attach it on here and see what everything, how everything works. Let's get the big boy. Where's the Titan header? Don't really need that. We'll just uh, we'll just grab that one for now, and we'll uh, just lease it. Look at that. That's perfect. Hold cow. Pretty nice. Makes in cab a lot easier. Oh, yeah, it might be. Oh, I'll have to try that, Kenny. That's a good option. I, I don't normally drive in cab, but that thing might make, make it uh, look a little better. Let's see. Uh, got that on. I know you can open the uh, pipe out. Ah, right there. Can't un it won't let you unfold that. Supposed to be able to uh, open the uh, doors on that thing too, right? 
I don't see a door open option. Disable straw. That's for the header. Probably make a big mess if I hit the button and change the driving direction. Hey, Trevor, what, what's up? You got to put the pipe in. Does it have to be on the harvester or what? I'm not getting a... Yeah, I'm, what's it have to be on? I'm on the tractor, but... Unfold harvester, pipe out, turn on harvester. There we go. It's unfold harvester. Okay. Probably has to be unfolded to be able to be used, correct? Like, just like the other ones. So there we go. So, can we get down the road? Nope. <laughs> Think unfold harvester. Yeah, I got it. I got it. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it. So we're going to go over here. Drop that off. Drop that off right there. Going to change the driving directions. Hey, it's almost like a transformer, right? There we go. A little bit more work involved in it. Because now you're going to need uh, a semi-truck and uh, a hauler for your header to get down to uh, get over there. So we'll just drive right over here. This is the field we're going to harvest. It's not too big. Can leave the header attached to the hopper. The trailer will pick it up. Ikea harvester. <laughs> oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Okay, well, I'm already over here now, so I'm just going to back this over here for now. Hey, Benji, what's up? Welcome. Oh, look at that. Went right to my semi. Nice. Ooh, I don't know if I can get out with the tractor park there. We'll find out. How's Charles doing? Good to see you. Need room to unfold it. Yeah. Oh, hell, I could have used that. I could have used, well, you know, never what. Forget it. You know what? We're, let's get rid of that uh, header I just leased. I could have, since I got to bring that down there anyway. Good to see ya. 19 awesome people watching. We're messing around with a new, uh, the new harvester that came out. Oh, will that not haul that? Should, shouldn't it? Yeah, there we go. Boom. So we'll run this down here. We'll drop the header off. 
and we'll go uh, we'll lease the trailer that picks up the other item getting laggy doing great a little on the warm 87 holy cow 87 I know I know it's been warm in Florida the last few days talking to uh, crazy crew Joe and uh, my sister I think told my mom the other day it was pretty warm down there so that's the only thing I ain't gonna like about moving south is that freaking heat but I guess that's what they make AC for right <laughs> So, will this fit in here? Can we? Yeah, well, we can make it. And we'll go ahead and we'll just drop this right over here. Uh, unfold. 89 for you in South Carolina, Kenny? Wow. Wow. Pretty warm. Yeah, let me uh, let me double check the weather here for us. I know it's nice and sunny outside. Uh, that was sixty one at ten. That was ten o'clock this morning. Yeah, sixty one out still. That's weird. It should have been a little warmer than that, I thought. But looks like it had been up to 64, so we'll detach. Nope. Oh. Had the wrong one attached. Targeted. The trailer is sure a lifesaver. I love it. Yeah, agreed. It is nice, right? Had that yesterday here in South Carolina. Today it didn't break 78. Oh, okay. You're in South Carolina too, Mr. Z. Nice. All right, so we got that done. Now we need the uh, trailer to haul the other bit. Why did Dom not finish? Ah, uh, I think he just got too busy, Ronnie. I think when he handed it off to the other guys, the uh, it was right after he broke his arm or whatever, and then he was having issues and he was gonna have to have the arm reoperated on. I think. But I, I do believe, I think that's why. All right. Uh, trailer now. Is that in a uh, trailer mod, maybe? I wondered why he did not. Yeah, uh, uh, Josh mentioned that too. I don't. I don't know why they they didn't. Those people that did that, I think, are friends with Bex. So maybe they forgot. I don't know. Uh, maybe he didn't want credit for it. I know he started the modeling on it. So you would have thought that they'd have given him some sort of credit for it. So there we go. Uh, change the color. So you can change change the color of the trailer uh, and the rims. It's a shame the headboard wouldn't have been able to be changed instead of the trailer color. But that's that's okay. Thirty nine grand for that. So we're just gonna go ahead and lease it. Boom. So there we go. Trailers. Yes, it was in the regular trailers category. Thank you. 16 awesome people watching. Hopefully everybody is enjoying it. 
Really nice setup. Yeah, just a lot more involved in it, Ronnie, because now you've got to carry, you've got to bring a truck, you got to bring a truck with your header trailer, and then you got to need a trailer for your box now. And it's it's something different. It's pretty neat. So I'm hoping I'm close enough. Okay, extend, extend arm, and I, and I, I do think DJ said there wasn't any collisions with that. So we'll find out. Oop. It actually had a early hookup. Did you see that? So you might be able to unfold it early. So then you can just pull up there and snag it. Right there. <laughs> it almost needs stabilizers on the other side of the trailer. Got it. And you got to remember to switch it back to the trailer when you're folding it up on there. Shameless plug time. Oh, it's getting close. Really? Holy cow. That trailer will pick up the box and header. Yeah, that's what uh, David was telling me. Might make it pretty hard for some of the... Uh, Get down some roads though. You can haul the header in on the haw part when you haul on the trailer. Would make it kind of wide. I really can't believe that it actually goes up on the uh, up on there and stays stable. <laughs> There we go. Oh, it detached the truck. Okay. Oh, there we go. I had it on the wrong one. So there we go. Now we'll retract arms. Boom, it clears the cars. Oh, okay. <laughs> Let's move this over here out of the way. Pretty neat. I, I you know, I like it. It's kind of it's different. Make a nice little make a nice harvester for on like a big map like Texas or something like that. We'll definitely need to uh edit the box though. Now we'll just drive over here and get our header. Oops, I should have had it the other way. Dang it. Ha ha! Boom. Twenty five K is good for base game. Yeah, it is Kenny, right? I guess. Edit the box. Yeah, edit the box, you know, like a har you would do a, a harvester to hold more. <laughs> Fifty thousand liters would be good. So there we go. Uh gonna unfold the harvester. There we go. So I'm going to do something here real quick. I 
I'm, uh, I'm going to get a screenshot here. Oh, I got to get out. Dang it. Stupid screen inf filled with information. It ruined my screenshot. There we go. All right. Now we're all good. Boom. Needs more group. Ah, <laughs> uh, no, not really. Don't forget I'm playing on PC. Need to unfold the header. Uh, okay. Header need to unfold it too. Oop, there we go. We've got lift off, everybody. So they said it would works good uh, being in the camera, in the cap. So here we go. And it, that's kind of cool. Look how it feeds in there. That's neat how it's working. It's got the auger in the middle of it. Pulls it. Uh, pulls the grain in there. Nice interior. It's got the little lizard on the uh, on the steering wheel. Got nice uh, in cab. All that good stuff. And it's nice, you can uh, line the field up with uh, the header. The header's right there so you can see it on the WTVS. Yeah, at least 50K, uh, David. Only you would think of that, David. Yeah, it needs more more power, like Tim, Tim the Tool Man. You can even hire a worker with it. Yeah, we'll uh, we'll get a pass on it, and we'll then we'll throw a worker on it, see how the worker works with it. Shameless plug time. Oop, yep, T minus two minutes and counting, Ronnie. Could do one pass on one of my simple Midwest fields. <laughs> yeah, I hear you. You get 25,000 liters off of a big field in a hurry. Calm down, Ronnie. <laughs> it says great. See, I'm at 57% I'm at already. So this thing, even on... Uh, this map is still, I'm, I'm not going to be able to make it back the other way with it all the way. Just like using a regular harvester in real life, right? I'm anxious to see how a worker uh, is going to uh, do on that. Welcome back, Nick. All right, so there we are. We're gonna. I'm gonna hire a worker now. There we go. Shameless plug time. Ooh, it is. Twenty awesome people watching. Y'all know what time it is. Hashtag it. Don't forget to uh, smash that like button. Let's me know. Let YouTube know you like what I'm doing. Helps drive the channel. If you're new, feel free to subscribe to the channel and hit that bell. So you get those notifications when I go live every day, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. So you can come here and hang out with a great bunch of people in the Farm Sim community. 
like to become a member, hit the join button. It's not required, but it'd be greatly appreciated. Like to buy some merch, head over to the merch store, buy it on up. Thank you very much. Have a great day. Oh, yeah. And if you join, you get a chance to play with me on the multiplayer servers when we go live over there on Saturdays. Uh, and uh, have some fun playing with us over there on the multiplayer. All right. Thank you very much. And have a great day. All right. So we're at uh, 87%. Oh, and it didn't stop the harvester when I jumped out, which was nice. How many do you think I should buy it to do blank map, the entire map? Oh, you better buy a lot, Benji. <laughs> Tag it. Hashtag it. Yeah. But welcome in. Good to see everybody. Worker, worker C is full. So let's go down here. I wanted to uh, check the dump speed out. You got to buy 50. Do you have uh, one big field on the blank map, Benji? Or do you have uh, several? Uh, empty pretty fast. Got a nice animation on that emptying too. Still empty and it gets down to that end right there. It's taking a little while. And empty. And this is just a contract. So we uh, grabbed the new harvester to test that out. It'll be interesting to see him turn around down here with the fences. One field, the entire map. Okay. It's kind it's cool, right? I kinda like it. It's working pretty good. Oh, oh, it's gonna do its backup. Doing its backup maneuver. <laughs> One field, the entire map. Ronnie, help you make that, Charles. <laughs> So I'm going to throw that right here. I'm going to hop back in the uh, harvester. I'm going to dismiss the worker. Would be neat to have a forage harvester like that. Or yeah, either, either that or put a forage harvester head on it and be able to use it, right? Right? So let's try something here. I just hit the... Uh, Real speed mod. Let's see how well it does with the real speed mod on. Nope. Would be neat to have a forage harvester like that. I wish you didn't have to remove feeder house to change directions out. Yeah, I, I don't like that either, Kenny. I don't know, is it designed that way in real life? Or it's all one piece though, right? In real life, the next gap, isn't it all one big chunk? Nope, did it all by myself. Oh, nice. That might be something to do like on stream. 
go on that map and buy it up and uh, plow in a field, see how long it takes. How long did it take you to plow the whole map, uh, Benji? Let's see, it still, still doesn't turn like a real near. Yeah, I didn't feel... I didn't think so. I thought that that box, that feeder box and stuff was uh, on there uh, all the time. 855 hours on that. Wow. I know you've been playing it a lot. I, I, you've all, you're always talking about playing on it. Oh, it missed, it's missing some. The, the brakes are kind of bad on here though. It, it doesn't slow down right away. It, uh, that's the only draw. It's kind of, Kind of lax on the brakes. Yeah, okay, Ronnie, thanks. I'm not for sure if it's like that in real life. I will have to look at pictures of the harvester. Yeah, I think I've wa I watched a video on it when Dom was first starting on it. And they, I'm pretty sure that feeder box is attached to it. So I'm hoping I'll be able to stop. Oh, why did I do that? Camera angle switched. Hoping to get at least near the tractor down here. Nice live testing of the new uh, WSVS harvester. Ooh, almost made it. Yeah, see, I hit the brakes and it still keeps going. Because I know, I think it's designed to do multiple jobs like harvesting and uh, I, th I think there's a, they have the ability to where they can put fertilizer and plant with the thing too. Which would be really neat, right? Instead of having the, the cedar box on there, you throw in a planter version of it. And then you could plant and fur stuff. Hey Ninja, what is up? How's it going Rylan? Cause then you wouldn't need a header. You just need to enter. You would just need to change out that feeder box for a planter system. Oh no, no collision on that. Can't remember. I used the biggest implement. Used the field creator mod. Ah oh, okay. <laughs> Ninja is doing good. Okay, well, good to hear, it, man. Good to hear. It. And uh, TGIF, to everybody just hopping in here. Let's see. Let's go here. Oh, yeah. See, going back this way, that kind of sucks because you can't can't see that end over there. You would definitely have to break the field up in halves, and if you wanted to drive in camera in cab. Wonders what he will fix next for it since he's asking suggestions. Yeah, like I said, uh, if they made a, like a planter box, they, if they took the one of the John Deere planters and made her and stuff like that, that they that are straight line. Like, uh, let me see here. I've got one of them, I think, installed here. Something like one of these, the 7,000 planner or something like that. Or one of these, something like that, that would fit in there. Eight or ten row, I don't know what you would, uh, whatever would fit in there would look kind of cool, right? Have it as an attachment.
Sounds like on MRG after the update release, the next release will be the final version of Medicine Creek. Ah, okay. Wonder if the swather attachment will work on it. Oh, I don't know. Uh, I don't think I can swath sorghum. I'd have to uh, plant a field and test it. You know what? Let's just go over here. I do not see why not, Kenny, right? You know what? We're going to stay here because I'm going to have to empty it again. Oh, uh, I mean, I don't think I can swath on this map because he doesn't have the swathing on here because he added the new crop. Yeah, I can't do swathing on this map because it doesn't have, and I don't have that swathable crops mod installed. He left uh, that off the map because he added the new uh, the new crop types on here. Oh crap! You see, yeah, the the brakes kind of suck on this. Didn't actually make it as far that time as I did the last time. Ooh, there we go. But we've got 50,000 liters of sorghum off this field already. For uh, a contract, that's pretty decent. I do know one thing, the Yosis mod that bales and instantly ferments, if you bale up the corn straw on this map on Black Mountain and Mason County, if you're on PC, you can instantly get uh, instantly get TMR from baling the corn straw since it, turn, it ferments into TMR, but you can instantly get it instead of silage. It turns out to be it ferments the straw instantly to TMR. I tested it last night, which was pretty crazy. But that's just for the PC guys, just to let you know if you're playing those maps and want to feed cows, just plant corn and bale the straw and wrap it. Welcome in. I see we got 15 awesome people watching. Thank you very much. Testing out the new harvester here on Deadwood. New map coming for all platforms from a poor boy and myself. And poor boy did fix the grass issue and was getting it sent back today. So it should get back on the testing list pretty quick, hopefully. He said it was a pretty easy fix, so that was good. He was worried because he had never seen that problem before, but which was good.
Holy cow, we're, we're going to fill up on this pass here. Wow. Getting, getting good yield off of this field. Actually, easy to change capacity on this one. Do, doesn't recognize the Swather header. Oh, why was there a worker on that? I thought I was running it. Doesn't it doesn't recognize the Swather header? Actually, easy to change capacity on this. Might try the tractor next. Oh, nice. Oh, it doesn't, Benji. Well, that. That boo. That that sucks. Oh well. We're gonna hit a hundred thousand liters of sorghum off that field. Wow. That's always good when they make it easy to do that, David. If you on PC, I bet you could make it reconnect to the Swather header. Yeah, I'll I'll buy a header. I'll I'll release a header and try it, Kenny. Ah, you could change capacity on PC, Ronnie. Just like anything else, it's called an edited. <laughs> it's called the dark side, using the force. If there's a will, there's a way. Yep, just add a couple zeros, right, David? <laughs> Oh yeah, and don't forget the uh, the weight add to. I can see Ronnie putting a global bag on it. <laughs> there you go. Instant million liters. Throw four of them up on there. <laughs> That's a pretty good idea, Benji. We're going to fill up before we get to the end, I bet. It's going to be close. <laughs> Just have to change it. Change it, what capacity, and add update mass. Yeah, that's it, David. That's that's the term uh, I was thinking of. Oh, we're going to make it to the end. How about that? It's going to be close. Boom, 98. I'm going to go up here real quick. There was just a little bit I missed up here. <laughs> yeah, the bag. <laughs> Couldn't resist. Mm, I'm surprised you haven't tried it yet, Benji.
I do believe, I think this is the first contract I've done on this map. I think I tested it once just to see if the contracts were going to work when I was testing the map for poor boy. Okay, uh, I'm going to go over here, put that out. We'll get turned around. We'll go get it. Yeah, we got 96,000 liters here. We're going to be over 100,000 liters of sorghum. Pretty good yield off of these. These long fields here would be good for like doing uh, your root crops in because you could put a worker on them and let a worker go and be done. Planning on it. <laughs> so I am going to, uh, Try full putting that thing on that trailer with the header. I want to see how it reacts. Get this done. We don't have any other field work. We'll have to pick up our bales up there. I don't have any hay yet. None of the grass was ready to be remowed yet, which is weird. Well, we've only been a month, though, so. Boom. 118,000 liters. Okay, where do we need to take it? it? Needs to go to the animal dealer sale station. Oh, okay. So we'll go up the road here. Go sell this. Turn it in. Twelve awesome people watching. Appreciate you all coming and hanging out. You guys got any big plans for the weekend? We're gonna watch uh, Rebel Moon tomorrow. The uh, episode uh, part two released today, but I wanted to wait and watch it over the weekend. So here we go. Let's see how much we get. Finished, and we made an extra 12K off of that, 12,779. And let's see. We made uh, 6,496 off of that, so we're up to 186,000. Uh, you know what? I'm just going to... I'm just going to leave that part right there for now. We hop back down here. You, are you, you, it will attach to that and carry it? I don't know. It looks like it's going to be kind of wonky.
it weird. DJ's video said there wasn't any collisions on that, and I'm getting all kinds of collisions. I don't know if I can get close enough with it, uh, with it tilted down there to get, grab a hold of it. No collision there. Yeah, see, uh, let's see, retract it. Put it back down. There we go. However, it does accept the Colossus headers. Yep. There we go. Here we go. Let's see if it goes flying or not. Ah, <laughs> uh, I think we got a problem. That header must be heavier than the ones you guys were using. Oh. <laughs> That's all right. We got a chance to use it. Pretty neat. Uh, I like it. Like I said, I have to get that box edited to like 50,000, 70,000 or something like that. Would be nice to use it on a couple uh, of the larger, larger maps to where you've got room to work with it. Oh, I just, I just dropped it off of that. You got to make sure you have it. I have the right one attached. I recommend it. Uh, if you've got, you, you want something new to use, uh, I would recommend using it. That will uh, go down here and get our, our header trailer, get our header taken back down to the field, to the farm. Header's kind of dirty. Come on, turn. Might not have room here to get that, to pick that up. Boom, there we go. Got to make sure you turn it back to the trailer when you're doing that. So since I leased that equipment, I'm going to go ahead and uh, return it so I don't get charged for uh, any more of it. But that's pretty cool. Uh, I would recommend uh, everybody grabbing a hold of it and trying it out. Something, definitely something a little different.
the grass finally re popped up over there. Nice. And I think we harvested that right there. I'm gonna go ahead and turn in here. Yeah, we can start prepping that field. Got lots to do. Ooh, that looked really close to the uh, fence right there. I didn't hit it because it didn't stop me. That's pretty crazy about the uh, that Polensity pol map from MA7. Did you guys, uh, anybody in here, are y'all hear about that? How it got removed from the mod hub? The damn, damn shame about that. I'm glad I still have that map. For now it's pretty uh pretty bad it, what the what happened with that anybody in farm sim snowy's discord uh, knows what i'm talking about so there we go we got that Oh, went right back to it. Sweet. So we'll go over there. We'll check our uh, root crop field and or because the van update that came out yesterday is yet gone again. Oh, I saw you guys talking about that. I didn't even look. What? What was up with it, David? Do, do you know? Any? Did it pass? Uh, and not work. I would have thought Looney would have found something in, when he was testing. He didn't post any notifications or anything on his when he made the video. So we got a few bales to collect. Take them down and put them in our bale storage. I'm going to run over here and check our uh, other fields. Okay, that field there, I think that's just growing. This is the one I really want, so I can uh, work on that field there. Oh, the red beet field is ready to go. So I am going to need uh, a, beet, a beet harvester now. And I, let me see, what do we need for that? That's 600K, holy cow. And that doesn't hold anything in it. Because I was going to get it and use it but, and run right beside it. And, but it doesn't hold any. We have uh, the toe behind. Oh. Where is it? Oh, I might have to go to the map. Because we've got the toe behind. Where? Where is it? Oh, that's right here, Deadwood. Yeah, we'll use the, uh, he's got a mod modified version of the, the rooster that we could use. Boom. Okay, Ronnie, you have a good night. Uh, I'm not sure Looney does or not. Okay. Thanks for the uh, super chat today, Ronnie. You take care, man. Have a great weekend.
Ooh, we got a 6K standard capacity. We've got a 12K Unreal or a 24K Unreal. 48, 96. Oh, so we're going to go ahead. We're going to run the 48K. That should give us a couple uh, passes with it. And we're running John Deere. Uh, design color, uh, John Deere. Uh, another design color for uh, John Deere. There we go. Hey, yo, Faber, what's up? Good to see you. How's Faber been? Thanks for coming by. Thanks, Ronnie, again, man. Have a good night. Uh, that's only 98K, so we're going to go ahead. We're going to buy that instead of leasing it. We'll just go ahead and buy it. So we'll, uh, we'll park that here. Oh, I forgot to change the respawn point. Boo. How's Faber been? Haven't seen you for a while. Hopefully you've been doing good. You're doing good? All right, man. Good to, good to hear. I have been very busy on Twitch. Oh, you're streaming over on Twitch now? Did you give up on uh, on YouTube then, Faber? Hmm. I don't remember shutting that door. Come on, open. We don't need that green trailer, so. All right, we gotta go down and get our, uh, did not give up, a double down. Ah, okay. Well, that's good. Hopefully it's going better for you over on Twitch or about the same. Have you noticed the difference in uh, doing Twitch and over there? Faber and Facebook, or not Facebook, but YouTube. I wanted to change that spawn point so I didn't have to drive all the way down here, forgot. Oh well. Hey, Brennan, what's going on? How's Brennan, the sexy beast, you? I said, uh, have you noticed uh, any difference with doing Twitch and YouTube? Does it seem to be better doing both of them? What is going on? How's Nuclear Salmon doing today? TGIF to you and Brennan. Oh, and Faber. Enjoy Twitch because I can say and play what I want. Ah, okay, cool. You can do that over here. You just got to be careful on what you say. <laughs> I'm doing good. That was good looking, Breeze. Ooh, you're talking to the wrong Breeze. I sure the hell ain't good looking, Brennan. Nice rock music. And, well, I swear. Ah, okay. Well, I swear too, but. So, Twitch is a better fit, but I am not giving up on YouTube whatsoever. Okay, well, that's good. Uh, glad it's going good for you over there. I don't do Twitch. I've been there a couple times and I really can't. I've never streamed over there, but always have a hard time with uh, Twitch staying active. It always seems to buffer. Yeah, but you can't play real music. 
Yeah, I I don't use music here anyway, so must be my twin. Yeah, my doppelganger, Brendan. <laughs> well, that's good, and glad glad you're enjoying it over there. I thought about doing doing it and doing a, a different game, doing other games over there, like combat games and stuff like that. I don't know. I don't think I need uh, the hall topper for that. I think it does it on its own. Oh, wait, I think I do. All right, so I got to go back over here. Uh, I need the topper for that too. Forgot. You're laying in bed. It's only quarter to five for you, Brennan, right? Ain't it like 443? going to uh, drop the header right there because I or the weight so we'll uh, put the delivery point here for now so I don't have to drive all the way back down there <laughs> I don't know if he edited uh, if this picks up wider or not we'll find out There we go. We'll buy that. Yeah, I think we've got to pick it up on this side. There we go. Sixty six Fahrenheit sunny and two forty four here. Oh nice. Sixty six, huh? That's a little warmer than here. Uh the new harvester worked pretty good, Nick. I liked it. Uh I would recommend uh checking it out if Okay, the The topper doesn't seem to be working. I don't really think we need a topper. I know I've used this rooster mod before. Let's see here. How do you like a uh, 61 here, Nuke? Yeah, see, I don't need a topper. I didn't think I did. We'll drop that right there. Get this little bit I missed. We'll go back up here and get our weight. Yeah, that's 61 is what it was here, Brendan, when I checked here a little while ago. Pretty nice day. Nice and sunny outside. I think they're calling for more rain tomorrow, so which is boo. Okay, I am going to uh, throw a worker on this here real quick. I need the window out real fast like.
There we go. Boom. Real speed mod. I've been taking a long break from Farm Sim. Yeah, that's what you were saying the other day, Nick. We're going to dial that down. That 30 mile an hour is a little fast. How about 19? There we go. Yeah, you said you've been playing No Man's Sky. But might try Alma for the new update, right? Yeah, I saw that had an update. Uh, I need to I need to update the map. Uh, I also need to update uh, American Falls, but I'm afraid to update American Falls because I don't want to restart everything all over again. That's just like Alma. Would be nice to be able to play Alma without having to update. But So there we're at uh, we're at thirty six percent already. Holy cow! With a couple of passes. I'm gonna hop out here. We'll go get the uh, dump trailer. I'm hoping I can get beside it so it will dump since we're running duels on all that. This way here now I'll be able to plow them two fields together. Actually going to plow together and uh, extend them a little bit. There we go. Might actually buy this plot of land here too. At the end here, this field. So then I can uh, mow that grass and get the hay. You see, I mowed all this grass around here and it's got me worried that it turned it into a field. Because when I was mowing around it, it... it it uh, was changing color like a field does. You could see where it looks like it's all field and, and all that. But yeah, I was thinking of buying, uh, well, that section right there and doing that. But I can I can still do some of this here too to make it, that field a little bit bigger. But I want to, I uh, want to, do this field here and that one I'm going to extend it and make that one field there too. You can see where I mowed the, the verges and it made it looks it looks like field which I don't I don't like that that's going to be kind of bad bad. I won't be able to use a worker worker on it to do any like planting or anything. I'll have to do all that myself or it'll really make a mess. Since that worker is, uh, he's doing okay at that, I am going to buy uh, a bale trailer. Pick up those bales. Because I don't think, I don't think I have one. No, I do not. Auto loot, yeah. In color. 
I did great. Ooh, gotta like it. The Ponzi. So I'll run around and I'll grab my uh, silage bale, or yeah, the silage bales that I made. Get them all collected. Put them up in the bale storage. Workers should be good till, till I get back here. Thirteen awesome people. Twenty-one likes tonight. Don't forget to uh, smash that like button. You know what? You know, it makes good sense and it's free and it helps drive the channel. Member for 21 months. Woo Thank you, Nick. Appreciate that, bud. Thanks, Nick. Appreciate that. Wow, it's hard to believe 21 already, right? Where is the time gone? Austin, what's up? Welcome in, bud. Good to see you. How's Austin doing? TGIF to you. All right, there we go. That is all done. I think we can get down there and back. Let's see. Yeah, we'll be able to get down there and back. Before he is ready to uh, be unloaded. We gotta go down here. Well, I guess it could have went the other direction. Gotta go all the way down to the end. Worker B. Oh, I guess I better go empty him then. I thought I was going to be able to make it. But I'm doing good. Pushing mow in my yard. Ah, okay, no problem. Yeah, I'm doing pretty good. Can't really complain. Been, been a pretty nice day. Kind of get cloudy out now, though. I think it's supposed to rain later tonight. Harvesting red beets. Well, my workers harvesting red beets. I'm just collecting them. So we got 76,000 liters of beets already. So we'll drop the trailer here. I 
comes the waterfall again. How big a yard do you have, Austin? You got a big yard to mow? Boom, there we go. Oh yeah, by the way, Bruce, my track meet went well and I have a small front yard and a big backyard. Ah, okay, I got yeah. Well that's good to hear the track meet went well. Nice man, nice. Did you get any medals in the track meet or is it just uh is it a combined deal with the school? So we're gonna drop this here for right now. The track meet went well. Nice, nice, good to hear. Here we go. I don't even think I have a plow bot. Or purchase, I should say. I don't have a plow bot. That'll be me. I'll be the plow bot. <laughs> Taking, gonna take a while to use that little harvester to do everything. Park that here. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and hop in the tractor here. Once he gets settled, uh, I'm gonna end him, and then I'm gonna I'm gonna start driving it. There we go. So welcome in, 14 awesome people, TGIF to y'all. Thank you for coming by. Hopefully everybody's had a good uh, good afternoon. Hopefully everybody had a great week. Hopefully everybody's going to have a good weekend. Whoa, David coming in with the sponsorship. 21 months for David. 21 months count. Let's go. Right on. So... Hashtag for David and Nuke for the 21 months. Hashtag for Nuke. And hashtag for uh, David. Much appreciated, gentlemen. There we go. Let's 
Why is that not giving me that one for David? Hmm. Oh, oh, do the one for David. Huh. Weird. But no, we'll just do that. Boom. Appreciate it, gentlemen. If somebody else earlier did one, was it Faber? Scroll back up there and look. Somebody else did one here a little bit ago. Oh, I can't see it now. My bad. Somebody else did one too. Appreciate you all coming and supporting the channel. Much, much, much appreciated. Hopefully everybody is enjoying it. So we're gonna we're gonna run this way here real quick. Get a small headland in. Hashtag for Nuke and David says Benji. Appreciate it, Benji. thing might actually be full by the time we get down to the end or if not before that I think that's only a four row we don't get the medals until at General McLean oh okay I got you Austin Come on. Oh, I should have probably went the other way. Oh, I see an ad. What? What is that doing? Skip it. Watch them ads, everybody. Woo. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> Boom. End of the track season. Okay, I got you. I got you. Oh look at that! He made it right to the end. Ha! <laughs> oh, we're gonna we're gonna drive on the crop anyway, so we can get it empty, and he can get turned around. I can grab a hold of it again. Hundred thousand liters of beets already. Still more than half the field left good day all what's up lifestyles how's it going man good to see you oh you know what i don't think i have enough money for the big john deere plow might just get the small one for now let's see are we gonna does that need plow Yes, it does. Ooh. No. This does. So does that. Okay. How's lifestyles doing? TGIF to you. So, has anybody used these? little titan disc versions that's designed for that that's that's a 16 meter plow you know what i'm going to get one of these i am going to try it and lease it and see how it works this is designed for the grape vines red green we'll do that so I am going to uh, lease this. I want to see how it works. Yeah, we got a 16 meter, which is a five row. It's actually designed to do for the grapes and stuff.
I noticed that the other day when I was in there, and uh, since I haven't done much with grapes, I really didn't realize it. It's designed for cultivating between the grapevines. Got to unfold it. Ha ha! Ooh, look at that. Maybe a one pass deal. Uh, allow create fields and <laughs> pretty nifty huh we are good on this side all right man good to hear you get all your rice processed then over the weekend or the other day So there we go. We got that created. We'll be able to uh, this is actually a cultivator but it can create fields also. So I'm going to limit the fields again. Yeah, see? I'll have to check that over here. I actually need to go this way with it. It's giving me a way different crop texture, but watch when I drive out on that. It'll probably create field. Yeah, see, it's creating a field over there on that. So you definitely need, definitely need to be careful going... in the grass area mode around your field or it will create it got it done now we have rice for a few months oh nice you don't you don't sell the rice uh their lifestyles but i am going to extend that field just a little bit so I'll probably, that'll be okay. I'm going to have to be careful. I won't be able to use uh, a worker, that's for sure. Hey, Joshua, this is Deadwood. It is uh, a soon-to-be released map from poor boy and myself. Uh, he just fixed it and sent it back to Giants. It had, uh, it failed testing, so it is back with Giants now. It'll probably get back on the list next week sometime. He uh, just fixed it up today and uh, re resubmitted it. So thanks, thanks for coming by today again, Joshua. Good to see you. Uh, T T G I F to you. Happy Friday. We're going this way here. We're going to uh, straighten this out a little bit. What kind of animals are on it? Uh, we've got cows, chickens, pigs, and sheep. Let me fold that up here. Let me, uh, let me drop this off over here. Anything is, I don't like that cultivated state. The state looks kind of neat, but I'll, uh, I'll show you they're down at the other end of the uh down on the farm over there uh i have sheep uh did i buy chickens it's got a customize uh oh he's almost full let me uh let me empty that out too just give to the family oh okay nice uh, i'm going fishing tomorrow oh nice austin good luck man the cow pen is custom he built it it's in built into the map it can't be deleted uh the pen field holds uh a thousand liters or not a thousand liters but a thousand head 
Uh, no, no baby animals. He did away with the baby animals because they take up too much uh, megabyte space when you add them to the map. So he did away with the babies. Let me, uh, let me double check. So if you're on PC, uh, I do believe uh, I've got baby animals on. So I, I think I've got that mod activated for the baby animals. So, the, let me go over here to the map. That's what the map looks like. There's your PDA. Uh, you start off with plot 50, 20, and 34. 34 down here is where your animals are at. Let me uh, hop to my tractor here. You've got a bale storage building here. Your cow barn, your cow pen pasture is here. It's got a water trigger. Your food trigger is over there in the middle. This here's where you buy them. Uh, 1,000 head. I've got 10 right now, 10 cows. So we're taking our time building up the animals. Got a little storage here. You've got a food, uh, food mixing building right here for mixing up your animal feed. Uh, your pig pasture, pig pen is right here. Uh, 500 pigs. Uh, the chickens are right here. Uh, 360 chickens or ducks, whichever you want to put in there. Uh, the sheep are right here. The sheep are, I think it was 500 also. Yeah, 500 for the sheep. So I started off with the small baby animals. Uh, like I said, I think that's the mod for the PC for with the babies. But that's your main farm. Uh, I've got forestry equipment set up over there because I've been doing some forestry, cutting down some trees for the sawmill on the map. Going with a friend of mine. All right. But it's got lots of production on it again. You've got the uh, carpentry building here. You've got sawmill here. You've got his oil production up there. Speaking of which, there you've got a, a cell point way up here. Uh, it's hard to get to, but if you can get to it, uh, you can make a little extra money selling pr product up there. You've got firewood. The quarry area is right here. And then you have your uh, crusher is right there. And you got your other productions here and there's other customs here. So pretty, pretty nice little setup right here uh, that we've got going on been keeping everybody informed on the uh, state status of the map because it's been getting uh, lots of uh, lots of good reviews and, and all that on it but thanks for asking thanks for coming by Well, we're doing our beet field here right now. Once we get it done, we're going to go ahead and uh, start plowing. I was using that cultivator there. I'm, I think I'm just going to buy a plow. I wanted to try that out. That'll work good for the uh, doing grapes. If you do grapes, that little Titan subsoiler disker. I'll have to sell another load of uh, wood to be able to buy my plow. <laughs> oh, let me uh, let me return the. Uh, I bought that. Where would? 
where'd that be at? I think it's miscellaneous, right? Yeah, right here. We can get rid of that because we don't need that. Quick AO from working on a 24 row planner. My head hurts. Hey, Chad, what's up? Uh, if your head hurts, you, sounds like you need to wear a hard hat while you're working so you don't bump in your head, Chad. <laughs> How's it going, buddy? Here's one for you. Meow. And another one. Meow. <laughs> how's how's chad doing other than your head hurting from working on a 24 row planner The, uh, the worker's kind of cutting off a little early down here on the end, I see. Hey, stop it. Booger, we got a very new new harvester today, Chad. Oh, uh, yeah, we got the, 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 the next cat harvester today, uh, Chad. Uh, I, did, I tested it out at the beginning. Works really good. Only holds like twenty three thousand liters, so it needs a uh, needs a bump to fifty. Trying to get the electronics, uh, uh, the markers repaired. Lots of tests. Oh yeah, I bet. Like electronics suck to work on. I always hated doing electronic works on vehicles because you never know where it's going to be. Start simple, work big. I guess you could say that's how usually you want to do it. Yo, 5 Gen, what's up? Yo, Bruce and Chat, how's everybody today? Doing fantastic. How's 5 Gen? T G I F to you. Hopefully you had a good afternoon. Been a good day here. So we're going to go ahead and collect this. Come on. Right now, sitting down for some pizza. Oh, yeah. Yummy. That's what we had yesterday. I know there's a little bit left. Uh, at least I think there's some left. If not, Mom probably had leftovers. I think there's a couple pieces left, maybe. If not, Sloppy Joe's for me tonight. At least that's the plan, anyway. Let's see, how much do I need for that plow? I, I want to say I think it's expensive, right? I could get that one, but I use that all the time. I want a real plow. I could get that one, but... <laughs> oh, it's only... Yeah, it's only 85K. I could use it, or I could get the speed tiller. That's 16 meters right there. That's the size I need. Mmm, pizza sounds good. Yeah, right? Wayland saying hi to Faber and Chad. It 
So once I buy, once I sell another load of logs, we'll be good. Nicky the fishy. Wish I could have leftovers with pizza. Not much leftovers in this house with a 15-year-old boy. Yeah, I hear you. Yeah, I had, uh, well, we had Pizza Hut pizza yesterday. Uh, Mama ordered garlic wings with it, too. So she ate the wings and a piece of pizza. And then I had, uh, I think, four slices of pizza yesterday with the medium. That left, I think, like four, three or four slices of the pizza left. We never used to have leftovers when there was when there was all five of us living together. Yeah, it, that that harvester there, the rooster, I think's like four or five uh, lifestyles. Uh, let's see. Let me uh, let me go here and see what it tells me here. It's six meters, or it uh, three meters. So it's like five or six. It's like four or five rows. Lifestyles. Two weeks. I'll have all that good food. Yeah, <laughs> right on, man. Right on. Can't wait. Right. I'm gonna I'm gonna wait go down there and uh, unload him when he gets there I'm hoping maybe we'll have enough time I'll be able to uh, load up uh, try loading a load of trees for you but at the end of the stream I know it kind of died off after I did that last week the other day it'll go a lot faster this time but I, I do want to be able to buy a plow what do we have here that's canola. Ooh, we could actually fertilize and lime that while it's still growing. That way it'll give me my uh, peak performance there, you know. We had, we had steak for lunch today. They they were on sale the other day at the grocery store. So mom picked a couple up. Man, they were really good. Look at that. Oh, we were running we were running wheel to wheel. Two hundred thousand liters off of that fuel. Holy cow, that's gonna be a lot. These should pay pretty decent. Let's see where our uh beats are gonna be at. They're way down here at the bottom, I know. That sucks. We need hopefully in the new game whenever it comes out, we have a different menu where we can uh, sort through it. <laughs> Or type in what we want so we don't have to scroll through all of that. Yeah, see, it puts it all these, puts them all the way down at the bottom. Uh, let's see. We don't own anything 174. So it looks like the fast food restaurant is going to be the place to be which is right over there so that is really good mm, the big bag works good 200,000 liters all right Ronnie nice man this side can't make tacos a pizza can't make tacos or pizza oh what why is that uh, lifestyles They don't have 
they don't know how to do it or is it they don't have the product down there to do it? I would think they'd be able to make tacos, but I thought every place was able to make pizza. <laughs> got half that trailer filled up. Wow. So I'm going to pop out here real quick. I'm going to jump in here. Cleaning this little bit up. How did I miss that twice? Guess that, that set of beats there don't want to go in the cart. Oh, another flipping ad. Yeah, see, that looks like it's a four row there, lifestyles almost. Yeah, that's four row. If you set it right, it might collect five, but if it it's missing some, as you can see, it missed some right there. So we'll definitely have to uh, go back through and uh, grab all that. Don't have the stuff and don't know how. The pizza crust really sucks here. Ah, okay, I got ya. That, that sucks, man. Getting ready to uh, getting ready to save. There we save. Hey, Rabbit Man, what's up? Good to see you. <clears throat> How you been? Hopefully everything is going good for you. Uh, I didn't get it all. Dang it. Been lurking the new Harvester mod. Looks good. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? Looks real good. Run runs pretty decent. Thanks for coming by. Hopefully you've been doing well. Ah, uh, we're not going to do that. I don't know where that's going to stop at, but... 300,000 liters of red beets. And they are 174 per liter. So should do pretty decent. Hey, hey, Josh, you made it. Good to see you. Doing great, thanks. All right, yeah, I've been good, man, been good. I can't really complain. Sorry I'm late, just got out of a two and a half hour interview. Holy cow, well, have all the interviews paid off for you, Josh? Hopefully, uh, I was going to ask you if you come in how the interviews were going. 
have you heard back from any of them? Matt looks good. Oh, thanks, Robert, man. I'll, I'll let poor boy know. Uh, been getting really good uh, comments off of it. Thanks, Luke. Hello. I won't be able to stick too long today. I'm working at, in the yard. Uh, no problem, Luke. Good to see you. TGIF to you. TGIF to everybody. The pizza here is about eight inches thick. Oh, oh, three eighths of an inch. Well, that ain't bad. I like I like thicker pizzas. <laughs> Sounds more like a flatbread than a pizza. <laughs> but yeah, hopefully all the interviews are paying off for you. He was all kind of wanting to wanting to know how it was going. Just one company so far, but the company I'm really hoping for hasn't called me back yet. Ah, okay. Well, hopefully, hopefully you hear from them. Good luck. Fingers are crossed, man. So he's going to have to make an, at least one more pass, it looks like. Yeah, hopefully, hopefully you'll hear back from him. Ooh, yeah, see, that's missing a little bit along the edge. So I am just going to leave that right here. Boom. Hop in here. Boom. Corn, what's up? 52K for the beats. Ooh, yeah, thanks. That's what we need. We need we need some mullet. I need to buy a plow. How's corn doing? Happy Friday to you, too, TGIF. There's Ronnie back in here. Happy Friday, says Luke. You know what? We're gonna we're gonna go ahead and uh, take over. And uh, the mat did get returned. Uh, he had fixed whatever uh, what the problem was, so which was really good. So it should be back on the testing list next week for everybody. Just to let you all know. Ooh, there we go. Oh, really, I missed it. Yes, this is part of the map, uh, Josh. This rooster is part of the map. He added it to the Mason County map, and I think he might have put it on the Crater Lake update also. And I do believe he might have added it into Black Mountain also. Most of the equipment that he use is using and modding, he is adding to all of his maps. All good here. How are things going, Bruce? Bruce, uh, doing good here, uh, Corn. Thanks, man. Can't really complain. Saturday in 25 minutes for me, UK. Oh, you're in the UK. All right. Well, happy Saturday to you. Rabbit man, early. <laughs> so we'll go down here. We'll empty this out. And we'll go uh, sell these off. Welcome in. We've got 18 awesome people watching. Appreciate you all coming and hanging out. We're going to go sell their red beets. Make some money. Should have enough to buy a plow after that. I like that little, the little rooster uh, model. Uh, I'm glad he deci decided to uh, make it to be able to do the root crops and all that. So 340K. We gotta go over there to the green bar. The green light. The green light in the sky. It's like Lucy with diamonds. <laughs> 
got to drive around because it's got fence line over there so the fields are surrounded by fences I could delete them if I needed to stream elements is working I don't mind that harvester and base game it's not bad at all just too small considering yeah it's 6,000 liters it holds uh, he did up the capacity. There's like three or four different versions of it for capacity wise, Josh. So that makes it nice. I tried using it oh, on the Erlengrot map when I was doing Sugar Beet Challenge that Gary had created and we were and was using it and the harvester would fill up before it made a pass, one pass on a field. It was made it tough to do that challenge all right here we go time to make some money three three hundred forty thousand six hundred liters we need to be over 120k yes all platforms nick now, 124K, so we made 59,000 plus 2790 environmental score. Nice. Now I can buy my plow. Woohoo. I'm happy now. Yeah, 99.99% .99 of poor boys' maps will always be uh, all platforms. He was toying about with the idea for a 4X map, but that's sidelined for now. We were kind of talking about it, and he kind of threw one together one day. So I would definitely like to see it before he does anything with it, you know, which, you know, me, I probably will. <laughs> but that's, that's a long ways off because he's got updates to the couple of his other maps that he wants to get out before he does that that's just a little side product project hopefully what's up jake mr j meister how's it going take care everyone i'll see you later good stream bruce thanks luke take care man have fun working out in the yard can't wait map looks good oh yeah thanks 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 nick appreciate it so I'm just going to pull this and park this here for right now. Let's go get our harvester. That little harvester got dirty doing that one little field, huh? Now we can fold it up and go over here. I'm going to need to put another building down too. Man, got lots of work to do. Bruce, will baby animals be on this map? Uh, I don't think so. I have baby animals on here, but I think I have the mod turned on for it, Rabbit Man. Somebody else was asking about that because I did buy babies, but I think he took the babies out because they take up way too much space in the mod for the mods. Way too many megabytes, I think. Looks like multiple meadow crops or they all mobile. Uh, meadow crops. Yeah, uh, you talking about like the grass and all that, Josh? This is the map he put your prairie grass in. The, I mowed all the verges around the fields and it looks like it give me field out of it. So, if that's what you're talking about. Because the field, uh, this field over here is your prairie grass, your tall right here. So when you mow this over here, it turns to hay. And the grass down in the cow pasture is your normal meadow or prairie. And which is regular, it turns to grass. But this here, I mowed all this here at the beginning to mow up to make uh, grass out of them. Thanks, okay, for the info. Yeah, you're welcome. Uh... I'll double check that and see, but I'm pretty sure I have the baby animals uh, turned on on here for this game safe. That's why I have baby animals down in my animal pens. 
over by the shop it looks like there's normal US meta uh, over by the shop uh yes there yeah there is Josh like right here he added uh, he's got that the normal meadow uh, he's got uh, this meadow grass there and down here around the houses he's got the good grass like see right here he did that so you could buy the land and for people who want to do like role playing and do like lawn care deals like because you can buy these plots of lands over here and then you can mow them for like uh, like that Sid Martin made a video about his new gleaner. Sid Marty. Oh, really? Okay, thanks, Ronnie. So, yeah, so you've got like four different grass types, right? You've got this mowable grass there. You've got the stuff around the shop up there. You've got the medium. you got the low prairie the high prairie grass so shame that lovely detailed map got removed so please on having it downloaded on ps5 oh yeah pledgeny rabbit man we were talking about that here a little bit ago josh made a post in farm sim snowy's discord about that last night because somebody made a comment and it got removed and i am glad uh i have it installed on the pc too it's a shame people got to be the, that way, you know, over one little tiny mod being used. Some people were just petty like that. Yeah, uh, polygony, uh, I think that's how it was pronounced. Uh, French map from that MA7 map, Monty, Ronnie. I got lucky, uh, I did my map tour on it and I didn't delete it. Usually it takes a month or so before I delete my maps off my PC. So, uh, I'm, I'm almost as bad as Blur when it comes to downloading maps and leaving them on my PC. <laughs> but the new maps I put in a different folder. So that folder all has the new maps in them for like for new maps for testing and doing my tours and all that. All right, here we go. So there we go. Hopefully that answered everybody's questions. So now since I've got the money, I am going to go ahead and buy my plow. So then I can get the plowing. Mm, let's see. We I want I want this one. Since we're running a John Deere farm, we're going to run the John Deere plow. So there we go, 85 grand. So that'll get us to about where we were at before, 37,000. So we're getting getting low again. It's way over here. Oh, I forgot. Uh, I wanted to lime and fertilize that one field. But now, since I've got uh, got a plow, I can go ahead and uh, I'll go ahead and extend this field here, get these combined, and do all that happy stuff. So welcome in everybody. Hopefully everybody's having a great day. Okay, that's got me, that's got a different ground texture to it. You notice that from uh, 
the plowed state, the cultivated state that I made over there had a good, uh, had a different uh, state on it also. You can see the different textures on, on the ground. We do have Bullet Bill's new uh, textures with some of the crop on here also. Just to let everybody know, sometimes I think I would like to do some modding. Yeah, I, there's times when I would too. I'd like to make my own mods to where I wouldn't have to download mods, you know, to be able to learn to do that or I could take them. I want to be, I'd love to be able to build my own buildings and stuff to use them for custom on maps. Which I think would be, a, which I think would be a lot of fun. So are we we are just outlining right now so I know where I want to where I want to go. We don't want to put it any closer to the road. Want to leave ourselves a little bit of a verge there. I like the idea of having uh, one building for multiple productions and then having separate spawn out points and stuff like that. It's kind of what poor boy has done with some of his buildings like his sawmill and the carpentry building where you have spawn out points for multiple products. Would just make it easier. So I am going to make go one pass up here. We are going to turn the create field on, which I don't think we really need uh, for the grass here, but oh, look at that! That was perfect. But it has the. Uh, dirt skirt around it howdy josh says david Boom, did it. Pretty straight too. Holy cow, I can't believe it. We're going to go ahead, I'm um, hoping I can get, we'll get this field done here and then we'll call it quits for the evening, everybody. It's good to see everybody as always. Ronnie, appreciate the uh, super chat again as always. Waylon says, hey David. I know there are plenty of videos out there to watch on YouTube about the modern deal, but most everybody, they... They go through it and don't they don't explain it good enough to in my opinion everybody goes through it way too fast they just sometimes they assume that most of us know what they're talking about when they do this and do that and
And I am going 25 mile an hour. I'm, I've got the, the real speed mod is active. I can explain it. Uh, okay. Well, well, I know you're busy and, and all that. I don't ever really ask. I know and I know you've offered a few times, so <laughs> but I know you get you get kind of busy at times and you've got your own stuff. I don't want to take away from whatever you're doing, Josh. And I know I would pick it up faster having somebody show and teach me and then I can ask questions while I'm doing it. Born Lifestyles, if you're looking for any help in learning how to do something, feel free to reach out. See, I have the hopper figured out, but working on another part. Ah, nice, David. Man, that was fast. And I'll probably extend this field a little bit more once I mow that other grass there. And buy that other plot of land. I want to get another plot of land bought first. I need to buy a forestry plot so I can uh, make some more money with forestry. Bex, what's going on? Happy Saturday to you. Hopefully you're feeling better than the crook. I'm a teacher at heart, so it's fun for me. I'm planning on offering one-on-one -on -one help to subscribers on YouTube once I reach that stage. Oh, nice. That's a good idea, Josh. Right? That's a, that's a real good idea. So we're almost done here. We got a few, couple more passes and we'll have this all done. Thanks for coming by again, Bex. Hopefully Bex is good. That's three, all three streams this week. Bex has been in. Nice. Good to see Bex running around. Hopefully the doctor's appointment from uh, Wednesday went well. Still crook me, but I have to go back to work on Monday. Ah, oh, man. All right. Well, boom. All, all good there. Well, still got a couple days yet. To, uh, hopefully, you'll get to feel better by Monday, Bex. Going to have to tough it out then, I guess, right? So, we got that all done. Our field is all. Let's see here what we got. I thought I... It says need plowed. We plowed it. Unless that was talking this. Oh, that was talking this. Yeah, see, this here is giving me a plowed info from prairie grass. Definitely going to have to uh, put a ver uh, little thing around the edge of that. We'll do that later. Why is that not showing up? I thought I sampled that it did huh oh well we'll have to throw down the uh it's not giving me the soil data for ah there we go ph is good so we're good there put 
put this over here. Gonna need to put a building down. So only got 37k. We gotta get get that done. Done. Gotta put a building down. Gotta got a loan to pay off yet. So we're definitely gonna need to make make some money. I can see some forestry coming into the deal. But it's just about that time, everybody. We're gonna be heading out of here. Uh, get ready for the weekend. Hopefully everybody enjoyed it. Working on uh, playing on the new Deadwood map. Coming soon to everybody. Like I said, it should be back on the testing list next week. Uh, the mod list is getting down there. So hopefully it'll be on there and doing really good. Yeah, I hope you get to feeling better too. Anyone see the wide span vehicle system on my hub? Yes. Uh, I actually used it at the beginning, uh, Bex. Nice, nice mod. Uh, I recognize that one name. That's your buddies, right? Uh, that BDDSD or whatever that it is. Billy Bob and whatever, right? See you later. Yeah, see you, Nick. Take care. Yes, it's pretty, pretty cool. Uh, are they working on making a planner for it, Bex, to go in there? Do you know? Hint, hint. Thanks, Rabbit Man. Nick, Richard, thank you. For, thank you all for coming and hanging out. Hopefully everybody enjoyed it. Been fun. I, I Man, I, like, like I said, it was a privilege to help poor boy with the map. And I was really shocked when he gave me a billing on it. So, yeah. BDBSSB is a good friend of mine. Yeah, that's what I thought. I recognized it. So that's cool, man. That's cool. Did a real good job on it, you know. It, I don't know yet. Hint, hint. <laughs> okay. So pass it along, Bex. Pass it along. <laughs> Planter. But we'll, we will see you all on Monday. Y'all have a great weekend. I'm out. I'm going to head on out here at 7 o'clock. Gonna go grab something to eat and relax. Watch uh, a little bit of TV here later. Thanks, Corn. Appreciate it. You have a good weekend too. Everybody have a great weekend. And it was good to see Bex again. Good to see Lifestyles. I don't like the maps where if you want to sell the farm, you have to sell all the buildings. I uh, usually, yeah, that sucks. Like that Lifestyles, right? Yeah, share the crayon says Bex. <laughs> Hey, Miss Hillbilly, welcome. You made it. Nice stream. Enjoy the rest of your weekend. You too, you too. See you, Benji. See you, David. Got the 50 meter header hooked to it. Oh, nice, David. Cool. Yep, see you, Richard. Take care. Y'all have a great weekend. You all take care. And thanks for coming and watching, everybody. Much, much appreciated. And again, thanks to Ronnie for the uh, dono at the beginning. See you, Lifestyles. Take care. Enjoy your two weeks down there in the uh, Philippines. So we'll see you all Monday. Take care. Have a great weekend, everybody. Peace out from Bruce's Gaming.